Oh boy, that just... Oh. That just gave me a jolt. No, not really. Okay, let's uh, try to destroy these guys. Um, it's 10, so I cannot do anything here. But let's see if I can... Oh, 5 and 7. Okay, I can do some good work. Out of ammo, just in time. Yeah, I think my uh, scout was gone. That's why I was able to overrun so quickly. It's 9, I think. Yeah. I'm not going to do any work. Okay, so why am I anti-air? No, I don't think I'll be able to cross. It's a helicopter, so can the Patriot target helicopter? I think there was a, a Patriot missile battery, but I don't think it can target. Yeah, I don't think it can target. Nothing. Okay. Let's destroy it. Thank you. Okay, now you are there to. This is just the unit to counter this. <laughs> Not really, zero in one. Oh my, do I have to actually pummel this guy to Kingdom Come once again? Oh, now this guy is pretty decent. Yeah, one and three. Not bad at all. Three and three. That's. Um, I should have used artillery first, but you know, they can hold their own. 5 and 5. So engineers are definitely good, yeah. Against the... Yeah, I don't want to waste too much artillery, but this is only a target that we have right now. Except for, uh, we have also this guy. But, you know, WS1 can take care of that. 5 and 7 now. 3 and 8. Okay, it's not too bad. Maybe I can... Um, Twenty-three. Well, it's time for so these big guys to pull their weight. Yeah, one and five. Exactly, exactly. Show these guys watch up. And overrun not possible. Perhaps this guy can overrun. Nope, not possible. I'm not gonna waste it. I'm gonna use the. I'm gonna use some of these other tanks. Yeah. Maybe shoot it from afar. Can I actually go down there and then, yeah, maybe just check, watch up. Now it's Bangkok. Yeah, Bangkok is within our sight. Oh, but, um, yeah, it's really close. And only like four turns I have played, so I mean, this is just another one of those crazy missions where time just seems to stand still. Okay, gone. Everyone's gone, folks. Wow. Everybody celebrate. And uh, I think there was a... Where was that helicopter? I just cannot find it. They just move everywhere. And it's gonna come, you know, sooner or later. And my uh, good Tunguska was destroyed by some uh, very... <laughs> I don't know, I shouldn't say it, but it just didn't seem right. Didn't seem right at all, because uh, these guys can probably... Yeah, let's say the better. This guy up to strength, and this guy's uh, very funnily enough was not touched. Very weird, but was not touched at all. And oh yeah, you here you are. You are done for. Um, let's check. This up. Yeah, I think probably it's open. So let's destroy it. Thank goodness, the engineers can probably uh, try to attack here. And uh, I think we have two more artillery, one here and here, and this is uh, probably a good tank. Okay. I remember in King of the Hills, there was a character, oh no, Hank's father actually calls uh, his other son beside Hank, Good Hank. Um, and that is a good tank. Uh, I guess uh, he was rather disappointed in his son uh, for some reason. Pretty fun show. Alright, let's move up and uh, get into the... Yeah, finally we are here. Okay, I guess that's uh, the entirety of the, the American involvement. Hopefully. The screening unit. But this guy can capture it. Oh, okay, so there's another guy. The Tunguska need to measure where he's going to stay. Um, 
Being around here would be nice. Yeah. And overrun. Okay, more units. Okay. Maybe overrun also here. 23. Yeah. Ah, yes. Alright, get these guys out of the way. Out of shells, that is bad. Can I have everything? Oh, wow. Americans. Yeah, American Marines. Now, can I uh, do something to make them pay? <laughs> uh, this HQ-7 will stay, and this guy will come down here and see what is happening, if there is any other uh, stragglers. Yeah, it's okay. I think it's rather stable, and need to take care of that tank. Airborne, uh, I think engineer might be the better in this case. Yeah, definitely better. Or anti tank? Okay. Yeah, we'll do it. Oh, not bad, not bad. Yeah, extra space. Maybe able to overrun. Good. And go to the airport. That's probably where the helicopter is. Try to get fixed up. I'm pretty sure of it. Three and four. One and seven. Sure. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Take care of that. Take care of that dang thing. Um, but yeah, need to scout it ahead. Yeah, there's only one lone artillery providing some cover. Now you gotta get out. And I think the Tungus can maybe be able to... Can my other units make it to there? For example, this guy? Yeah, I think so. Infantry, right? Yeah. Um, but can I cannot spend too much on my tank strength because of the... Yeah, because of the presence of tank over there. Maybe I should use the... Oh, there's a WS-1 that is unfortunately out of shells. Yeah, okay. Uh, maybe this guy can reveal what this is. Oh, it's at night, so... Yeah, probably not. 1 and 8, sure. 6 and 7, get out. Oh, okay, fine, 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 fine. Is this the, oh, this is actually clear, yeah. Yeah, but it's all wetland and stuff like that, so if this guy comes, it's going to be in a pretty bad situation. I'm gonna make it, yeah, I'm gonna hurt him, hurt him pretty bad. About that, and overrun, possible. Yeah, it's a pretty experienced tank. Uh, this guy, has six range. Yeah, same range. Might as well. Yeah, might as well. The Tunguska that was destroyed. I think they had all the attachment to. Which is not good. Yeah. And maybe air strike or even the I mean Okay. Oh, I have a tank heading here. Okay, so good good. Oh wow. Scimitar to recon. Okay, so I mean uh, and I just landed on top. Just below the helicopter, wow. But I think I can do some strikes here. Uh, maybe I should leave it until the end. Yeah. And this guy can go, but not now. Oh, yeah, I have a range. I have a range. Oh, this guy is... Yeah, this guy is gonna get... He's dead. Okay. 
stream it. Yeah. Huh. Seems like we're going to leave this um, our area open for now. Uh, need to take care of it very soon. Yeah, gone. All right. Okay. So this guy is kind of out of sorts. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, wow, this. Okay, that's pretty amazing. And this guy. What to do with this guy? Okay, so uh, airstrikes there. No, I don't think so. But I need to hurt this guy. A very strike might be in order. Tunguska, um. Yeah, Tunguska should. Once should stay. And can I buy something? Can I buy 200? Okay, I can buy, um. I think an anti tank. Airborne. Oh, already moved. Okay. Yeah, I don't really see any big... Oh, still has a lot left. Yeah, it could be pretty... Yeah, I could be in a bit of a hurt. Let's see if there's any air guys nearby. I don't see it. But some of these guys have like huge ranges. But I don't see it. So... Ah, okay. Worked. Worked admirably. Okay. Stay there. Uh, you... Uh, back off. Screen unit. Okay, you screen. Yeah, right here. Scout. Okay, good, right, where it is. And this guy, yeah, stay where it, where it is. Yeah, it's almost out of ammo too. Now, should I buy another unit? To prepare for the... Airstrikes that's going to come. I think so. I just leave with it. Thinking about defense to support this uh, WS1, maybe I should. Because I just can't uh, fathom losing it. Alright. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty bad, but luckily. Yeah, yeah. What was that? Where did it. Oh. Here, okay, so this guy shot at this guy and I lost an ammo but still can shoot twice and there's a helicopter here. I think I can see it, but thankfully, you know, my guys are just... There's so many of them, so just was able to handle it. Okay, let's see. Uh, Alright, so Americans have taken over. Yeah, typical. No, just kidding. Uh, it's like, we're gonna save you. We can do a better job of defending this space than anybody else, that's true. That is true. Out of ammo, it's going to stay there. Yeah. No more... No more of these guys. Uh, wow. Light Infantry 2001. Sure. 3 and 2, yeah, American guy. Uh, yes, and uh, calling all and Tunguska. This guy's seven. No, is this one or seven? 
can't really tell. Ah, uh, one. Oh, still be able to damage. How was the battle estimate? How was the... What was the battle result the last time it attacked this infantry? Maybe that's where it lost a lot of... A um, lot of strength. Yeah, this is a Patriot missile. Battery, I'm sure of it. And the recon might be able to do some work, yeah, finally. Do some work here, and yeah, there's a Patriot, there's a Strela. There's a Light Infantry, pretty cool post. Oh, that's 22 and 14, wow. But this guy can do a pretty good job. Yeah, 7 and 7, right away, wow. Such a, yeah, such a great unit. Entrenchment doesn't care, does it? And yeah, engineer is going to F things up. Uh, not really. But F things up, will ya? Side, okay. Can I overrun? Oh no. Yeah, I just just messing everything and leaving no unit unturned or no hex unturned. Sorry. Okay, so yeah, maybe I should just yeah, destroy this guy and capture it. I think the Thai still has a lot of uh, air mission points. They didn't really spend a lot, I think. I don't know what to think about that. 11 and 1. That, that is the truth. Yeah, that is impressive. Okay, now. Let's see what is happening here. Oh, abandoned it. Okay. Good. Now this guy will just stay here still. Uh, just to protect. Screening unit. Uh, just there, screen this guy. And just go straight to this artillery. Uh, I'm sure that... I think the tank might be able to capture this point, Lam Lokka. Uh, I'm sure that there is a, some kind of defensive infantry or some such in transition. Even if I get ambushed, I don't think I'll be uh, damaged too great. But I can uh, definitely look. Um, I, maybe I can do some recon uh, from this side, so let's do that. Okay, yeah, there's some guy, but not, not nothing to be um, alarmed about. This guy has no ammo, so you're stuck. And let's burn some tread. Okay, so this is similar to the type version. I think this is but a variant. I cannot cross here, but I can go around. But why do that? My infantry can handle it pretty ably. Uh, maybe go for this guy. Ah, support fire. Yep. Beautiful to the very end. I don't think shooting at units uh, compromises this guy's movement. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay, now let's spill over this side. Let's take over here first. Uh, I'm sure there is artillery somewhere nearby, um, but I think it'll be okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. This engineer a bit too full of himself. Because I uh, didn't really realize that engineer is kind of bad against these guys. Yeah. Um, maybe you can handle it. From afar. Yeah, good. Uh, another engineer? Okay. Yeah, engineer really doesn't really have to... Scout can look over and see what they have. Oh, it's getting smaller, the movement is getting smaller. Okay, two Thai garrison. Not really strong. And now we can come back. 
Uh, this guy, yeah, alright, let's see what happens. This guy also needs to get its strength back. It's only... Um, it's only task is to uh, defend the flank and to capture spaces. Uh, maybe I should run these guys over, or the... Yeah, the tanks probably really need to come pretty quickly. Yeah, I think so. I think you can make it. But the Tunguska might have to also try to keep up. It's out of the range now, but I think by now there's not really much of a threat of concentrated attacks. Yeah, Bangkok is all taken over, only the small part of it. Opening up the way, just like I did at... Uh, where was that? Vladivostok, yeah. I did too. Three left, okay, good. Alright, so, is any other... I have a screening guy, but I don't have any... Oh, okay. Probably look over here. Oh, okay, yeah, here I have found some unit. Artillery that had targeted this anti-tank, people running away. Now, it's going to be in target of this. And overrun, probably. Good. And my Tunguska can keep up. Barely. I think you'll be able to be protected. This guy needs to get its ammo back. Nice. Alright. So working out. Engineer. Uh, engineer, yeah. Although the road is open, the bridges are all uh, open, so these guys can... Yeah, need more strength, infantry strength here. Okay, now, uh, very important. I don't think I have any targets right now. So I um, pick here. It's like a new base operations or something. And uh, screen right here. And this guy, yeah, just stay. Yes. And yeah, top target. We get entrenched. This guy stayed there. Yeah, okay. You know what? I just keep watch over here. I don't think I really need to use a lot of units anymore. So just keep the objective safe. Uh, at least uh, with this unit, it's pretty fast and able. HQ7. Yeah, stay there. Uh, type of 5. Oh, I can still go somewhere. Okay. Yeah, come down here then. Alright, so one more turn. No, six turns left. Oh, I'm used. Yeah, not a good result. But they were able to destroy one guy. Wow. And, uh... Engineers. It's all engineers. Okay. Yeah, just destroy it. Yeah, oh, this guy could have done it, but uh, no matter. This guy will just protect Bangkok. Yeah, there should be a lot of more rivers coming through here. I'm, I'm sure that, yeah, this is the Chao Praia River that goes through Bangkok. It's uh, often known as the, I believe, the Venice of the East because of the rivers. But yeah, right now my concern is here. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, could have been ambushed. A bit tonight. Oh, okay, capture this. Can you make it to here? Yeah, okay. So. Oh man, this guy gets. runs out of the. Oh, it's a British unit. Runs out of the ammo like every other turn. Now this guy can do some work. Yeah, okay. So four here, nine here, let's do it. Yeah, get out of the way. Five and two, okay. Yeah. That's great. 
No, not the screening unit. Where's my other... Oh yeah, I remember my scout guy got destroyed. Yeah, so I need to bring in... It was overrun, basically, in the west. Pretty crazy. I mean, that's the amount of strength difference that we are talking about. And, you know, granted this is like the, the lowest and the weakest unit probably in Chinese army. Alright, so nothing much. Engineer? I don't think engineer can do it. Yeah, just drive it out. Drive him out. And, uh... Yeah, let's... No, I would like to make... Maybe, uh... Um, doesn't really matter which unit captures certain points, but yeah, let me surprise. Wow. Now, engineer, can you do something? Yeah, not bad. 6 and 4. And maybe overrun. Yeah, still has a lot of turns left. 4 and 2. Wow, these guys are pretty tough. Can you. Okay, just. Alright, yep. Just suppressed it all to heck. Yeah, it's out of movement points now. Get the instrumentment down. Uh, two, yeah. One down. Remember in Panzer General 2, some of the attacks, if it's not effective, it doesn't even decrease the entrenchment, so... One and six. Seven and three. So it's open field now. Yeah. Open field. Okay, so... Airborne. Airborne can... Yeah, destroy this guy. Good. And the engineer. Yeah, engineers. Finish this guy off. And I think we have one more objective left. One more. And another two hour mission. Now it doesn't really matter. Just that I take some time to edit. Always trying my hardest to streamline that process. Oh wow, I can actually uh Ah okay, yep. Nope. I was a bit too rash there, yeah. Is this the prototype? What happened to the prototype? Um, I don't know, but prototype... Anti-tank. It's somewhere here around. I think it's somewhere here, I think. Um, oh, I think it's protecting the back, the rear guard. Or maybe it was lost somewhere in the crazy battle that didn't shoot. Oh, this is the guy. Yeah, this is the guy. Maybe I can try to bring this guy. No, I think this guy can make it to any other objectives. Yeah, this objective. Scout, stay. And, um, yeah, Tunguska, you protect here. The super artillery, still protected. Screen these guys. Yeah, okay. Okay, so... Yeah, I think, I think I'll think i be able to capture everything in the next two turns. So I'm not going to move all these units. Just rather protect, rather protect these guys than risk anything else. Okay, this guy can... Uh, I guess come down here and this guy can join and HQ7 can protect here yeah and this might be able to protect the airfield later and this guy we're not well this guy can move a bit but I'm not gonna just risk too much this guy can over here okay good uh scout yes I think Scott might be... Yeah, just stay there. HK7, good. Uh, type 90. Okay, I moved this guy. 
just in case. Uh, yeah. Yep, stay, stay, stay. Uh, yep, stay. Screen, yes. Oh, that'll be an active unit. Uh, it's okay, I mean, hopefully I'm not making any mistakes. Alright, so... Oh, wow, okay, so they've run out of everything. Let's just take it. It has been a long mission. Yeah. I don't think I have destroyed all of these units. Outside of the range. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna lose out, so... Engineers might have to take some pot shots. Yeah. This guy also. Oh, a bit better. And now I can... Oh, okay, no matter. Alright. Ah, uh, if I capture it? Yes. Then it's going to be game over, or mission victorious. So I just, you know, give all these guys chance to do something. Uh, maybe the helicopter too? Uh, well, no. Is it? Uh, maybe I try it. I don't know. Uh, there's anti-air, then it's going to be... Yeah, this guy is, uh, wow. We're protected. Alright. Okay. I guess I have one more shot. Four and four, yeah. Okay, yep. Yeah. As to be expected. Ah well, let's just finish it. Eastern Brilliant Victory, 17th Victory Hexes captured. Oh, okay. Your victory in Thailand has driven a wedge deep into the cracks among the Western nations. Their fractious and covetous nature has them bickering over the spoils of defeat as they squabble among themselves for false assurances. The Premier is confident that your leadership will soon see a dissolution of Western influence in Southeast Asia and a return to the respectful and orderly values of our people. Ah oh, yeah, sorry, I just clicked ahead and didn't check the map. It's mostly captured, left maybe one objective somewhere, but it was all captured and um, yeah, I mean, it was a pretty well prepared mission. I spent like 20 minutes trying to uh, go over the details of what to do. I think there was a bit of a mistake because I didn't expect the Americans to be you know, based around Bangkok and the city that I need to capture on the road to Bangkok and the British was stationed on the other side. They didn't really mix up their I guess, strengths. Although the helicopters were kind of close together so I didn't expect it. I thought the right side, the eastern side would be rather undefended and the Bangkok itself is going to be just ringed with Americans and British troops waiting for us. But no, that's not what happened. And uh, I think the Americans brought one very great tank, Abrams tank. And um, yeah, there are a lot of great artillery. I was surprised. It was, I think, to the class of our uh, Chinese monitor. And then the Thais were, Thais were equipped with pretty decent mobile artillery as well. Um, so it was um, pretty interesting. And there was like one particular turn where uh, General Ling's uh, offensive lines or front was kind of straining under the pressure, but I was able to just wrap it up in a way that took some time, you know, a lot of clicking around, but was able to stem the uh, leaks, so to speak. Yeah. British tanks are pretty decent. Challenger 3, I think. And there are a lot of recons and anti-airs, but I didn't really see a huge amount of anti-airs like the Russians and the Vietnamese brought, which is surprising. And uh, yeah, uh, the particular instance where the Thai air mission just, you know, through rings around our air defenses to kill that experience. Tunguska was pretty unfortunate. Yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy with the brilliant victory and like with a lot of turns to spare. Maybe um, 
I'm not really getting the hang of it. I guess I cannot really say that because of the, you know, the new units and factions that are entering into the, entering into the battle. But as this guy says, it's already driving the wedge deep into their so-called coalition, and uh, they're kind of squabbling among themselves on who to blame. Um, spoils of defeat. I guess spells of defeat kind of means that if the country was kind of leaning toward isolationism and not really intervening in the Southeast Asia, uh, probably could use this as an example, spoil so to speak, to convince the electorate or the people to, you know, hands off Southeast Asia. I don't know, the China is definitely uh, going pretty strong and, you know, there is still a lot of battle to be fought. They don't really uh, relish the thought of actually going into the city of Bangkok and, you know, fighting or something. Yeah, I mean, you cannot really tell this is the city of like 7 or 8 million people. And there should be a huge amount of uh, city left to yeah, occupy right down to the, the Southeast Asian Sea. Or is it the... Uh, I don't know what ocean it is, but yeah, it's Sea of Something or Something Sea, I'm not so sure. But there is a um, opening into that body of water. There's a lot more fighting to be done, but for now, Link's job here is done. Penang, Malaysia. The crumbling alliance of the Western nations has managed to assemble significant forces on the Malay Peninsula in a last ditch effort to hold on to their imperialist positions. As the only modern port on the west coast of Malaysia, the capture of Penang is critical to our efforts of strengthening our defenses against the threat from the west. We must advance across the Rai River to seize Penang and secure the roads south in preparation for an assault on Singapore. Wow. So we are going down from Thailand to Malay Peninsula, which is Malaysia, and cannot really uh, transport some of the you know, heavy equipment there, so we need to find another one that is Penang, uh, which is west coast of Malaysia, which means that it is open to you know the United States and Britain transporting their supplies. It makes it much easier for them to do it. Now they have to go down, the Chinese, and the ultimate battle being the Singapore. I guess in Southeast Asia at least. Yeah, Singapore is going to be one heck of a battle, but you know, we are talking about Penang, Malaysia. I don't really know about Penang, but it must be a pretty big city, uh, given that it's only modern port. Or maybe by now there are other modern ports buying the services of other nations in trade. But yeah, right now this is an important area. You need to capture it. Seems to be a bit more um, dry and more European, as you can see. Some steeples there or something, but Malaysia, I think, is primarily Muslim. 1818. Okay, at least it's easy to remember. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's check the dossier first. Yeah, seven brilliant victory. Wow, we are on a roll. Four straight brilliant victories with like a lot of turns to spare. I don't know, the, maybe the balance is a bit um, now toward the Chinese given the amount of overstrength that I can do on the infantry to like 26. And yeah, look at that, they have, their prestige is now, their experience is now 772, 774, and 1048. This guy has been with us probably for the entirety of the campaign. 824, so I mean, you know, Maybe they're counting on the fact that the Americans will bring more units. 405, 620. Yeah, now this has blasted through the thousand mark. Yeah, it's over the limit. But I think it still counts in terms of how effective you are as a tank fighting unit. Let's save. Well, yeah, I'm kind of getting worried. I haven't saved for a while. And this is not the most stable game. Okay, let's see what kind of U units the Chinese might have brought. Okay, so nothing for the uh, nothing for the tanks and here. Nope. 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 Let's check right here. Nope. Uh nope. Nope. No, so nothing. How about the Russians? I have a Russian. 
the unit that I had kept around just for this purpose, just in case there will be some new units on the Russian side. Well, it's nothing much, but yeah, there's nothing here that I can upgrade to. And how about the Grumbles? Uh, well, I mean, I can upgrade to these guys, but this guy, this uh, unit has served us pretty well. And some got a lot of experience. Well, not a lot of experience, but you know, a certain amount of experience. Okay, well, that's that. Alright, so, yeah, next time, Ling is going to find himself further down in Southeast Asia and going into Malaysia. Uh, thank you once again for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and next time, until next time, please stay tuned.